Hello everyone, this is your Sunday evening CareQE.com webcast. Here's Chris Gilson with a quick look at the forecast. We're going to see our skies clear out as we head into the overnight hours. The winds will stay on the strong side as we head into your Monday, but not as strong as they were on your Sunday. Sunny conditions, mild temperatures tomorrow, climbing into the middle and upper 60s, so not as warm as it was last week. Then as we head into the middle of the week, we'll see a chance for some rain. And then by the end of the week, another chance for some rain as another low pressure system moves across the region. That'll also drop our temperatures for next weekend. Crystal? The news of the Lobos being listed three seed in the NCAA tournament came down in front of a packed pit today. Hundreds lined up around the corner waiting to get inside the pit this afternoon, swapping green for cherry and silver this St. Patrick's Day. Fans continue to cheer on the Lobos after welcoming the returning Mountain West champs home. Lots of people hoping for a number one seed or even number two. And as we mentioned, they'll be number three seed playing in Salt Lake City, Utah. They deserve a second seed because we're number one in the RPI rating today. And I think that uh, they got jipped, but a third seed is still good. We're going to Salt Lake City. We really deserve a second seed, but uh, we'll have to match up with the Harvard Crimson, and we'll have fun playing that. And my wife and I are going to Salt Lake City. Yes, Lobos will be playing against Harvard for the first game. This is the 14th time the Lobos will make an appearance in the NCAA tournament. UNM is not the only New Mexico team that will be dusting off their dancing shoes. New Mexico State got an automatic bid into the NCAA tournament. The Aggies defeated UT Arlington 64-55 for their second straight WAC tournament title, which will send them to the big dance. Today, NMSU learned they are the 13th seed in the Midwest, Midwest region. The Aggies will be playing a fourth seed at St. Louis in San Jose, California. That will be on Thursday. Stay with KRQE for more news and weather updates. I'm Krista Gutierrez. Thanks for logging on.